about to happen here. Now, this is India right here, and this is, now they call it a cyclone. We call them a tropical storm. This is a tropical storm. They call it tropical cyclone. Its name is Tote. And the problem here, this thing is moving northward into a very favorable environment. This thing will probably undergo some explosive intensification over the next day or two. And in the next couple of days, it looks like it's going to make a direct hit into the Indian state of Gujarat. So if you have family back in northwest India in that state of Gujarat, this is going to be a potential disaster with that storm. It could be a borderline Category 3 hurricane by the time that thing hits. We'll keep you posted on that. Back home, of course, much quieter. So through the night, these showers are going to be approaching. But notice toward morning, they start to fizzle out. So we may start the day with a few scattered light showers around. And some of us, honestly, may get through the night dry. But still plan for a few early showers. Those dry out. And then we actually start to get at least partial sunshine for the middle part of the day. And the computer models are now trying to de-emphasize a little bit some of these pop-up showers in the afternoon. We've been watching this for a couple of days now. There may still be a few. You see there are a few little dots on the map here. Again, I think more of us, in fact, most of us, will probably get through the afternoon drive, but you have to be aware that there could be a shower. So just keep an eye on the real-time radar in our app, and you'll see uh, if anything's approaching you. But we'll be dry through the evening, so basically not a bad day if you want to do some barbecuing. All right, 53 is the overnight low tonight, and that's with a cloudy sky and just a few showers around, and the wind will be light and variable. And then tomorrow, yeah, you could fire up that barbecue. I th again, I think we're going to be okay. 55 to start. 72 for the high, and then take a look at this seven-day forecast, guys. I'm just stepping out of the way. Look at the end of the week here. Not just 80. We're talking about mid-80s and maybe even beyond that into next weekend with maybe some thunderstorm chances toward next weekend. So get ready for some summer.